Now, Tom, you've recently took on a new product range, the wheelie machine tool range. Why was this? Well, we needed to uh, fill a gap in our portfolio. Uh, we, as you know, sell Brother, which is a BT30 high-speed machining center, up to a thousand meter in x-axis travel. We had a lot of requests from customers who wanted bigger capacity with a bigger spindle capability. And having searched the marketplace, uh, we came up with Wheelie and uh, looked at their range, big range, and happy to take it on. They have a huge range, not just the three axis machine that we're going to review today, but fifth axis machine, bridge style machines. And how does that really fit in for you? Is it, is it, does it open new marketplaces for White House machine tools? Well, of course, it's a big range and we do sell into niche markets. So having the smaller C-frame machines like we're showing today and also the big bridge column machines, five axis machines, vertical turning machines gives us many more opportunities and hopefully opens a few more doors for us. Now, we're going to review the AA series today. Now, this is a three axis machine, but what's so special about it? It's such a saturated market. You know, why would people look to buy this particular type of three axis machine? Okay, the first, this was the first machine that uh, we ordered for stock six months ago. And the reason for that is that we wanted something which was a bit of different in the marketplace. Maybe for not such a, uh, a big sector, but this machine is really designed for heavy cutting uh, and precision fin finish machining. Uh, what makes this machine a little bit different is firstly it's got square section guideways, uh, turkite laminated, hand scraped. All uh, component parts, mating parts are hand scraped. Uh, the spindle on it is a two speed gearbox, uh, 8000 RPM with a big plus spindle and it delivers nearly 500 newton meters torque. And on a BT40 machine that is, uh, is quite high. That is really impressive. Now let's start with the guideways. You mentioned the guideways. Now, is it all about rigidity, this machine? Is that what these kind of guideways are giving you to be able to cut them really hard materials? Yeah, it's, it's about the rigidity, really. You uh, compromise on the rapids. We've got 36 meters a minute on rapids, where on the linear guideways tends to be 48 meters a minute. But most of the companies that are cutting hard metals are quite happy to compromise that fact. So let's touch on the spindle now. You mentioned 8,000 RPM and you mentioned a two-step gearbox. Yeah, well the two-step, it's automatic. It changes automatically whether you want to be in the high or the low range. And it depends very much on uh, size of cutter, uh, feed rates being used. But maximum torque, as I say, is nearly 500 newton meters. So. It, it will uh, remove uh, material seriously. So it's really giving you a lot more torque, a lot more grump. It's really giving you that, that power that you need to get through them hard materials. And also, one point to make is, is, is it, do you need to incorporate different cutting strategies? We hear a lot about high feed, small cuts. This is a different type of animal, isn't it? Well, it is. You can still adopt that sort of uh, strategy, but uh, you know, sometimes you just need the torque at the low RPM. And I think that's the big difference, really, is that uh, there are going to be strategies where you need uh, a low RPM, but you did need to deliver a lot of torque. And how many tools does this free axis machine tool hold? We bring them in as standard with 40 tools. Uh, that's the maximum on this machine. Uh, and it's got a three second tool change. And that's quite quick as well. Now, how does the machine move? Tell me a little bit about the size, the envelope of the machine, the movement, the speed of the movement. Well, the axis movement on this machine is uh, 1100 by 650. Uh, it is a machine of a series. So we do offer bigger machines up to 1500 meter in the X. So uh, this is one of the smaller models in the C-frame section. And we, as I say, we go up to 1500 millimeter uh, with this type of construction. Does it come with high coolant pressure? And has it got a swarf management system that comes with this machine? Again, standard 20 bar through spindle coolant, 
with a separate clean tank, uh, additional filtration, two Y-axis screw conveyors and a Caterpillar conveyor to discharge into a bin. And the programming language of this particular model? Uh, we buy with FANUC control normally, uh, but we can offer high name control as well. Now, Brother have got their own controls, you know, programming control. So how do you, how do you find backing this kind of control language up? No, it's fine. Most people know FANUC. Uh, most people these days are programming offline, so post processors are quite easy to come by from most of the suppliers. So it's no, no problem at all. What I've picked up so far from this interview, really, with the Welly range, you, it's not just a generic free axis machine that lends itself to most applications. They are quite application specific. Is this correct? And in a day and age, in a day and age where people are really looking for turnkey and bespoke solutions, is this the kind of market that you're really looking to get into? Well, it's a market that we've we've always been into, really. It's uh, you know this is uh, this is what we sell, really. Is the it's the after sales side. It's the engineering support. Uh, even with this machine here, we are providing a, a semi turnkey solution. Uh, we're putting on a rotary table, uh, which is uh, partly interfaced by the manufacturer anyway. It's already prepped for fourth axis, so. We can put four axis table, five axis table. We'll do the programming for the customer and prove out. This is pretty normal for us and we've been doing that for years.